They even had an elephant staying here. Welcome to another Quazy Ride. And in this video, we are showing you our recommendations on where to stay in Bressanone. As we are building the digital tour guide with Crazy Rides, we share all the information on our tours, our rides, and give you recommendations on where to stay in the central point of a tour. And if you are booking one of those recommendations, we do ask you to use the links that we provide in the description of the video, on our website, and in the ebook that you can download for free from our website because then we will get a small fee from the booking.com fee. It doesn't cost you and we can keep our crazy adventure going. Our first recommendation is also in the video on what to do in Barcelona to make your stay here even more fun. And this Hotel Elefant has pictures of elephants everywhere. And if you want to know why, watch that video on what to do in Barcelona, which will be in the middle of your screen after this video. The hotel is on a very central location, so perfect for exploring Bressanone after your rides here. And it even has a swimming pool and is situated in this beautiful historical building. And of course, it has its own private parking. And although it says you don't need a reservation, we always recommend to mention that you want private parking for your bike. Remember that a fee will be added to your hotel cost and this is not the cheapest hotel, but honestly, none of the hotels in Barcelona are very cheap. Even more central in Barcelona is this Krone Eat, Drink, Stay. And according to one of the reviews, it's perfect for hikers, cyclists and bikers. And on the website, it says that this hotel connects the city to the mountains. So it sounds good. And it has its own private parking garage but know that a fee is applicable, but then you can park your bike safely here and you're in the middle of Bressanone. Here in this fairly quiet location where the two rivers split and on the edge of Stufels, the oldest part of the city, you can find this Hotel Residence Gasser, part of the Grunerbaum Hotels. And it's still only a few minutes walk to the city center of Bressanone and the on-site parking is free. At the station square of Bressanone, you can stay in this hotel Jarolim, in a beautiful Art Nouveau building. It is a family-run hotel built in 1891 and restored in 2020 by the fourth generation. It is only a five to 10 minute walk into the city center of Bressanone. It has a private parking at the back and although the website says that a fee will be added, a lot of reviews on Booking.com says it's free. If you don't mind a 20 to 30 minute walk or a short bus ride from and to Bressanone, you can stay in Hotel Leuwenhof. It is very easy to get to on the bike, so maybe a perfect accommodation for your stay during the Mighty Dolomites Tour. And there's enough private parking on site, and the campsite where we stayed during our Mighty Dolomites Tour is just behind this hotel. Well, we think we showed you a few good options to stay here in Bressanone. So the only thing you have to do is decide when you're going to do the Mighty Dolomites tour, book the accommodation of your liking via the link that we provide, and then download the rides that you want to be doing and watch the separate videos on those rides. And then 
go crazy. And then we hope that you liked this video. And if you did, please hit that like button, subscribe and hit that bell as well. So we will see you on our next crazy ride.